in the summer I threw potato peelings into that compost bin there and they grew now a lot of people don't put potato peelings into compost for that very reason but to me it's just another crop but at the end of the day I'm composting who cares what grows in it but we are now at the end of January and I need that compost out of there so I can reuse this bed as you can see all the others are full but there are potatoes in it some of them are no good because they've broken through the surface and they weren't like held up or anything but there will be some in there that are okay so let's go and have a look at what's going on as you can see all the old potato homes are still here so we're going to pull these off and put them up here for now there are potatoes sticking through the surface and a lot of these won't be any good now but because I've left them until January but I just want to show you that just because you've thrown something in the compost doesn't make it no good S excuse me junking you around so we're going to use this bucket and we're going to stick everything in it even if they're bad we'll sort out stuff as we go but um i mean we've got potatoes all over the surface here and some of them are quite big and they're even chitting so we could even use some of these as seed I mean, look at these potatoes. And what I'm gonna do, wow. I might even weigh these and have a look at seeing what we had out there. But, look at this beautiful compost. And a bonus crop too. How many of you guys throw potatoes in the compost? Or potato peelings, I should say, in the compost. Wow, look at that one. There's some great sizes in your... There's another big one there, look. We'll have a look at these. There's some white ones in here. But for now, I just wanna dig through it because I need to use this compost up and get my bay back. Now I've got a few, oh look, I'm sp even spiking them. And that incidentally is a reason why I don't like potatoes in the ground because you end up ruining good spuds digging them out. Let me pull you more this way. Can you see there? I'll be in your way, I know, but look at that. And these spuds are all right. Look.
Well, you can hear me panting, but you'll have to excuse me. That's filled that bucket near enough. And you can guarantee I won't get them all out here, but we will get the bulk of them. What I should do is pull it out onto the deck out there because I need the bin anyway, but oh, look at them. They're still coming. And some great size spuds. And most of them are all right. We might be here a little while, guys. So, that's the one bucket. I'm gonna stick that up there, out of the way a minute. And that little spud has fallen off here. Okay, got another empty bucket. And I'm gonna continue digging through this.
on. Well, apart from that real rotten one here, yeah, I mean, look at, look at these spuds. They are brilliant. And look at them. I don't know how many pound I'll buy you, um, but I will weigh it so uh, we can see what we got out of that compost heap. And I'll put it on the description by you now. But that's all from potato peelings. So we just need to, I got an empty bucket here. We just need to tear out the weight of the bucket. Oh, this, this foot is loose. There we are. Tear that out. There we are, we're at zero on that. So let's put the first bucket on, which is this big heavy one. Oh. I'll see, I don't know if you're gonna catch this because the frame rate of the video, but I'll try and get it on my phone. So this is the first bucket, it's 18.145 kilos. Oh. And the second bucket. That is 14.35 kilos. So what well, we got 32 kilos of 60 odd pounds worth. I'll do the calculation now. So the calculation is 32.495 kilos so 32 and a half kilos let's do that 30 let's do that into calculation what's 32.495 kilos into pounds 32.495 kilograms is equal to 71.639 pounds 71.6 pounds guys of potatoes that i grew accidentally well <laughs> there you have it guys i grew over 71 pounds of potatoes by accident and that's just from potato peelings that i threw into the compost heap now a lot of people would be annoyed at potatoes growing in their compost i'm really not bothered if you look at this i've got tons of worms in this compost this brilliant stuff and incidentally I've written a book on composting as well so um, that'll be coming out in April so keep your eyes peeled for that and for more information but 71 pounds of potatoes is amazing and obviously some of these are huge I'll just grab a couple I mean look at these things you know I mean who can whine about that now what I will say like I said it was a pain when they were growing in there. I couldn't add anything else to the compost, but it really wasn't an issue because I've got enough capacity that they could allow them to go. And potato peelings, well, if the compost is making and it's making me potatoes, why not? 71 pound of potatoes for nothing from potato peelings, I'm a happy chappy. I know they're good spuds because it's good compost. And I knew where the potato peelings came from because I grew them myself. Anyway, guys, if you want to know more about potatoes you can view this video here and when you've done that don't forget to click the subscribe button and give us a like on your way out anyway thanks for viewing remember folks you reap what you sow and i'll see you in the next one bye bye